will be very exciting for each and every one of you that has been consistently following some following me well aside the reading aspect we're also doing let's talk let's talk we have so many issues around but today's special focus is on text messages and chat messages fine you send a text to someone and the person refuses to respond or the person doesn't even acknowledge your text and you get to see the person sending or dropping a message in a group kind of message which obviously insinuates that the person has either read your text on the chat or has read your text as a normal regular message now i have with me my essay to say janet and doi we'll be doing the talk on how would you feel when you send a message and the person neither acknowledges it or even responds to it so stay tuned well let's go right straight into it okay the the, the program is actually what we're going to be talking about today is let's talk and um, while we're talk, doing this talk is because we uh, several times um people send messages and they don't get response so in your own understanding in your own view is it something nice is it is it necessary for you to acknowledge a text even if you don't have anything to respond with or is a message that uh, you don't have to you don't need to reply i mean you don't need to respond in any way but for you to acknowledge the fact that okay i got this text sometimes it could be missing in action so just saying okay yes so how what how would you feel if it was done to you uh me you could not respond to my text i don't really care because if I don't think the text is so important, I will call you by the way. For me, I, I, I get it that people are busy. So I think. Well, for me, it's a matter of, like you said, if it's something that requires you to just say okay to, but not necessarily our text message that you sent out requires like a response. So if it's something you just want to acknowledge or something like that, so you just be like, oh, I need you know, I send this to you. The person could just like simply read it and like you don't need to reply to that. Mm -hmm. So I feel like it's not not all text messages actually need to reply to. So you like the mom's text messages to me. Exactly. <laughs> all those chain messages like, okay. that my bro. No, so it's like, as long as I can see that you read the message, that's fine to me. Because like a lot of the text those messages, chain messages. Like, yeah, easily just like okay, I know the person received it. That's not the matter to me at the end of the day. So what if there's a regular text? That you don't know if the person received it or not. Basically, take for instance, Janet, I called you and I sent you a text and I'm like, oh, okay, um, I got this, I got this, I got that. You understand? At least I need you to respond to me that okay, you got the text. Or maybe I asked you, please, could you help me get this? You understand? And you seem not to respond to it. How would you? It's, it's, it can be hurting you. I don't know what, what how you feel about it. But really, it can be hurting. You. I remember a lady telling me she sent a message to someone and the person did not respond to our own message. And the other person did not respond to our own message. The person kept reading other messages. And maybe she just um, showed um she, she, she now sent a video. She now sent a video to the person and the person checked it and you know you could see that the person clicked on it or even responded to the one smiley or the other. How would you feel? What's your take yeah. on that? If that happens to me, where like the scenario just like where we know that they saw it and they responded to us, but not mine. Yeah, clearly I would feel hurt, but at the same time, like the way I mean, I guess me personally, if I feel like maybe I've offended that person, or maybe they, maybe they should be offended. Or to, yeah, I might then reach out to them, like, or maybe wait till next time I see them and bring it up. So it's not like. I'm smiling at them, but deep down I'm feeling this way. So maybe I'll wait till one night to see and then I'll reach out. And uh, with the, I guess the first one where it's like, you've been going back and forth and um, I guess, how, is it how to end the conversation? Is no, not like really ending a conversation. Exactly. Not really okay. ending. So, yeah, just case, just I'll sending you a message and I expect a reply. I'll and wait I don't get when it. I see them and if I'm not going to see them, maybe like when I I actually speak to them on the phone. Call. Or, 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 or I don't call you. I'll just ask. I'll call. Just ask. Like, yeah. Yeah. because yeah. if it's something that needs a response, oh, then I'm expecting a response. Or, mm -hmm. you know, to be like, um, hi, did you 
received? Did you receive? I just sent a follow up message. Just like you sent an email, you know? Did you receive a previous text or just following up with my previous text? What's up? What's your response? Because that was like, to me, see, I can't really talk about it. She's guilty. Guilty of not responding. Unfortunately, it could be like so many different reasons. Like maybe, you know, I'm in the middle of something like so. Okay, I was not there. Thank you. Yeah, like I'll see a message, and not that I don't want to respond, it's just like it will just keep my mind. Like if I don't respond at that moment, if I'm like, oh, let me finish this and I'll come back, I will come back for like another couple hours. Like, I will forget okay. and not respond until later. Like, oh snap, I forgot to. Read. So many times I'm like, oh, I'm sorry for the late response, and then I'll respond. Okay, at least you got you said you're sorry for the late response. Yeah, so people like, don't sometimes, like, sometimes, I, sometimes I forget, <laughs> and then the person will like, like, you know. Oh, and but it's like just a follow up, oh shoot, sorry, and I respond. So sometimes now, now if you ask a certain time and they still don't respond, then there's more to it than that. Yeah, that okay. is beyond the text message. On my way, on our, on our way here, I was about to text somebody because they popped up my hair, and then I realized the person actually messaged me and I didn't respond. And I was just about to just say, like, hey, what about you doing? And then I saw, oh, okay. yeah, like oh, that, that happened. Yeah, like I go for my birthday now. There was like two yeah. messages. Like I tried, I tried to be diligent to respond to everything. But like two people so sent messages at like eleven thirty, and I, so like, I totally forgot. I just saw it. So like, oh, okay, I just went to and said thank you. Doesn't mean that I didn't want to respond. Okay. But those people, people probably think that oh, I didn't send that message. I should not respond. Okay. But like it wasn't intentional. Sometimes it's not intentional. Mm-hmm. But if you're sending messages. Multiple times and there's still no response. Yeah. Not about the messages. Yeah. There's also, something going on in that. It also depends on the relationship that you have with the person. Okay. So with some people you know that they're not doing this out of spite. Like, right. you know, right. like when she doesn't respond. I, mean. <laughs> I know when she sees she I mean. eventually <laughs> So what if it's a boyfriend there for a relationship? Ah, no, 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 the guys that I don't, I don't do it now when I live here. Yeah. And I feel like I'll be the one. Like the guys that don't respond. I feel like I'll be the one that I'll be like, ah, I'm sorry, bro. By the way, the second one is the one that's. Nah, I'm calling your bro. Like, what's up, bro? Yeah. Like, what? I know you have a different relationship. Yeah. If it's better than your friend, husband and wife, or you better be responding. Right. If it's something that is important that you feel like you need an answer to and you realize that the person is ready and you didn't respond, I'll feel like. I mean, call. Doesn't matter. Like for me, there's some people that there's some people that won't see their names on my phone. Right. My siblings, my parents, like automatically, <laughs> I respond. Whatever I'm doing in this world, I could be. Can I say this? I could be at work with a patient, and I'll say, "Excuse me," and I'll walk out of the office because my brother's stuck. Like priority. Like if you don't respond to that person right away, right. it could be that you know, like she's a. Like, Oh, like it could be just out of annoyance, like okay, somebody's constantly just bombarding you with messages, messages. And it's like at this point, okay, so like, you know, I don't want to respond. I don't buy like, different. Like okay, I can tell. Like you know, you just have that moment where you feel like you know, I don't want to respond. Let's just sort of continue. Mm-hmm. So it's like a whole different. Yeah. You know, like some people have like something. Like, yeah. Like, just very, say, like for me, for instance, I have a lot of people that just say, cool "Hey, what's up?" I'm like, "Yeah, nothing much. How are you?" And they won't respond. <laughs> and then maybe two days later, the rest, the message again, <laughs> "Hey, what's up?" <laughs> Like, hey, how you doing? And this yeah, was for like six months with these people. And you know what? I'm like, okay. Oh, right. <laughs> it, it, my response is coming. Wait for it. <laughs> this is that I never responded anyway. But they keep mess- messaging the same thing. Like, that one is not my only I'm not going to respond to you anymore. No. So basically, in other words, you shouldn't get angry when so. someone doesn't respond no, to your messages. It's so busy. 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 All right, oh, I still must have come in. I'm like, let me, when I have a break, you can not respond. But I just, I never remember. Like, I forget, I'm like, I get home at night. You know what I mean? Like, when I'm going through my phone, like, oh, yeah, I'm supposed to text me at 12 o'clock. You know? Yeah. Uh, so that's the case. But sometimes, see, life 
But if you oh, if you are a boyfriend girlfriend kind of person, you get angry, oh, I beg. Oh, <laughs> so he will be taking you for granted, or she's taking you for granted. Like, you send me morning, like, you send me morning, just like I'm missing you, and I'm gonna text. Yeah, if I'm if the boyfriend and daughter will respond, probably like we finish at the moment. It's probably like this agreement going on. But if there's no disagreement going on, they just ignore. Oh, that's the only thing. Yeah, yeah, mama. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Yeah, check it out. <laughs> so thank you so much for this kind of words. Um, I really appreciate your genuine con- contribution, and thank you for staying tuned. Until next time, it's let's talk on Joker's show. Bye. <laughs>